Hey everyone, this is Larry. Welcome back to todayifeellike.com. Today, I have something kind of cool and special. I want to show you how you can get free internet access anywhere you go. You can get it at home, you can get it in your car, you can get it on the beach, you can get it anywhere you want to get it. Let's go check it out. Okay, so in order to get our free internet service, we actually have to go pick up a device. So you ask, where might that be? Well, let's go find out right now together. Here we go. everyone so I made it here to my free internet I'm gonna head inside to go get it so let's go uh, let's go get the device and then I'll show you guys how it all works This is the hot spot. So, if you guys haven't figured it out, there it is. We went to the Loudoun County Library, and uh, we were able to get our 4G LTE hotspot. And uh, yeah, we're gonna hook this thing up and uh, and get it going. All right, everyone. So I am back here in the office. I went ahead and got this. I'm gonna set it up now. So I'm excited. I mean, I went there, they had it for me on hold. I was able to pick it up. And if you guys weren't aware, I was at the uh, Sterling Library in Loudoun County. Now you can get this at many different libraries. Many different libraries around the country have uh, these different services where they have digital services, they have electronic services, technological services. You just have to check your library's website so you can find out uh, what services are available at the different library branches in your area. So, But we're going to go ahead and uh, open this thing up, see what comes inside the little package with it, and then we're going to get it set up and see how it works. All right, so here we have it. This is it. Let's go ahead and open up the, uh, the package here and see what we get inside of it. So we'll take this out and we're going to uh, set that off to the side. And here we go, it says, do not return to Dropbox. I guess they wanna make sure this thing doesn't get wet or uh, damaged or something. So let's see what the con uh, what's in the little container here. And first we have uh, instructions here. It says Loudoun County Public Library, T-Mobile Wi-Fi hotspots. It says available to customers in good standing for seven day checkout. It says can be renewed if no holds, deactivated within 24 hours if not returned by due date. So. Technically, I guess you really have like eight days because it says seven days, but you have 24 hours to, uh, to uh, 24 hours, otherwise it's deactivated. It says you can provide access to up to 15 devices. Access is dependent on T-Mobile coverage. Uh, kits in, uh, the kits include the, uh, the mobile hotspot or the hotspot unit, which is right here. So we have the hotspot unit. Um, it has a USB cable. So let's check that out. Let's see. Um, this is the USB cable. So there we have that. Um, a, and plug-in, uh, oh, USB cable and plug-in. So this is the power brick, so that's that. And the carrying case, which is this right here. And yeah, so um, there we go. It says customers responsible for associated cost, uh, associated loss and damage, kits 103, uh, hotspot unit 68, USB cables 15, carrying case is 25, kit must be returned to the service desk, do not drop in Dropbox. All right, so there we go. So, um, that is everything here. There is a password on the back of here, it looks like, so you can, uh, so you can get this set up here. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, just go ahead and get this thing uh, plugged in and set up. So I'm gonna grab my phone here, and let's see, let's make sure there's some power in it first. So let's turn this on. So we'll get this thing turned on here, and let's see if there's any juice in it. Hit the power button and see if anything lights up on here. There we go, it's lit up. That's what we wanted to see. So let's go ahead now and, um, and let's open up our Wi-Fi and hit that. 
and we'll see if it shows up on here. I'm not sure what it's going to, let's see what network it's going to show up as. It should show up as Hotspot, uh, or it should show up as LCPL. So let's see if that shows up on here. LCPL, which I do not see. So we may end up having to, let's just hit the, we'll hit the WPS thing on there. We'll hit that there and see if it shows up. So we'll hit that and see if anything happens. And I'm not sure, so far I'm not really seeing much. Oh, wait, nope, that's Bechtel, something else. Nope, I'm not seeing it because this is an, uh, an Alcatel or something like that. So um, yeah, we're still not figuring it out. I'm still gonna, I'm gonna get this going though here. I'm gonna get it going for us. So let's see, all right, there we go. Something's flashing on here. So now let's see if this is gonna show up. I may have to hit this, might have to turn it off turn that back on there, and then let's see, it should scan for new networks. And so, let's see here, oh, there we go, LCPL, let's hit that there. Now it's gonna ask for my password here, so we'll go ahead and put that password in there. So we're gonna type in read at, let's see, read at book. So there we go, read at book, we're gonna hit connect, and let's see if this is gonna work. Hopefully it's gonna work. It says connected, yeah, look at that. We are connected to the device. All right, we are connected. Let's go ahead now, we're gonna check here. Yep, it says I'm connected to LCPL. Let's go ahead and run a, um, let's go ahead and run a, uh, a um, whatchamacallit, one of these speed tests on here. So we're gonna hit the speed test thing there and we're gonna hit go. We're gonna see what kind of uh, internet speeds we're gonna get with this. So it says right now, it says connecting and then finding server. And there we go. So let's see what the, if we're gonna get any decent speeds or if it's gonna be slow. Oh, it's not too bad. Right now it's showing about, um, about 15, 16, 17. So we're at about 17 up. So far, let's see what we get for the down here. So this is gonna be interesting. So we have, uh, let's see, the download or the upload speeds. So we have, we're at about five, four, five. So it's bouncing about four or five. So we, for our downloads, we already had 17.7. And now we're looking at about five, uh, about five megabits up. So yeah, 17.7 .7 down and 7.79 up. Um, that's not bad. That is definitely not bad. This is, this is going to be pretty cool. And look how small this is. You could literally put this in your pocket. Um, you can keep it in this little bag. You can throw it in a purse. This is going to be great, especially if you could, um, if you, if you go on a road trip or something for the holidays and you need something like this, you can put it in the car and the kids can have it. So, um, yeah, this is, this is a, a definite win so far. All right, everyone, so there you have it. That is how you can get free, completely free, 100% free, 100% legal internet access anywhere you go, in your car, at home, at the park, at the beach, at work. You can take this wherever you are, wherever you go, and it's absolutely free. So now you can get this from your local libraries. You just need to go to your library's website, search on their website for their technology services section or where they may name it something different. And then you just need to go on and find out if they offer these wireless, uh, these wireless modems. If they do, just go ahead and check one out and pick it up. It's really just that easy. Now I have been doing a lot of uh, uh, videos on all the great services that are available at your public libraries because, well, they offer a ton of free stuff that's really great. There's all kinds of digital services, technology services, they have classes for language. Uh, when I was in the library today picking this up, I saw they are actually having a class this weekend on how to build your own PC. They are doing a ton of stuff at public libraries and it's all free. So anyhow, there you go. So you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and follow me on Facebook. And I am Larry with todayifeellike.com. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace. Peace.